Cowboy Bebop live action is very similar to the Avatar The Last Airbender live action in the sense Six that it speed. does not exist, okay? You have uh, a beautiful work of art, a masterpiece, if you will, and, uh, you know, and then disgusting, uh, you know, Ameroids who fucking destroy it with their filthy little Western hands. And it doesn't matter because yeah, it never really happened. It never really occurred. It's not a real thing, you know, and it never it will be a thing, okay? I will not watch this. I will not watch this uh, show. I will not watch this movie. I will not. It's not a thing that existed, okay? My chat hassle. <laughs> Amara Mutz. <laughs> I love that. Avatar The Last Airbender is a Western show. That's true. Uh, by the way, uh, a marvelous loco. Thank you for the five gifted anime. Thank you Super for the 10 the gifted. QCL. My girlfriend is saying to stop saying fucking please help me get laid. What? Tucker's uh, interview with Kyle Rittenhouse is not tonight. It's on Monday. Anyway, do you want to see? You want to understand why this fucking sucks, okay? We all remember. Okay, you want to see why this fucking sucks, dude? Here. Two bottles of we're feeling dangerous. Two bottles of we're feeling dangerous. Sounds to me like blackmail. I'm right it is because, Chad, you are black and you are male. Anytime you guys piss me off, I'm going to play this clip. Anytime you guys piss me off, I am going to play this clip. This is the most Yakubian shit I've ever seen in my entire life, dude. 0% chance a white person wrote that. I do not know how this actor, who is a black person, was in the room, heard that line, and went, we are not doing this. This needs to not be in this script. This is one of the most insane things I've ever seen. Okay. This is like, what are you doing? Why? Black people already have to deal with systemic racism. Okay. Black people don't get self-defense fucking uh, uh, protection under the criminal justice system. On the weekend that Kyle Rittenhouse remains free. Cowboy Bebop is still like, no, you know what we're going to do? We're going to do worse shit, okay? <laughs> I'm going to run it again. I'm going to run it again. I'm going to run it again. Two bottles if we're feeling dangerous. Sounds to me like blackmail. I'm right at this because, Chad, you are black and you are man. <laughs> you are black and you are male. <laughs> Adopt me. We're being good. Stop, stop. Nope. I'm right at this because, Chad, you are black and you are male. I just, it's. This will go down in history as one of the worst, one of the worst clips, sound bites of all fucking time, dude. Sometimes I feel like they just, uh, they go full memes. You know what I mean? Sometimes I feel like a lot of these shows just straight up say, fuck it. We know we suck. We know this shit's going to suck ass. I think we should just go full uh, lean into the memes. You know what I mean? Nancy Pelosi. Yeah, Nancy Pelosi after wearing the kente cloth and kneeling for uh, Black Dude, Lives Matter before giving like public places in before LA giving uh, American bombs, police forces up. attack helicopters. <laughs> you are black and you are male. <laughs> you missed this Cowboy Bebop clip? I haven't seen it yet. Uh, how are you, Woodcut? Better. Now there's a tall glass of creamy chocolate milk. <laughs> How are you, Woodcut? Better. 
Now there's a tall glass of creamy chocolate milk standing in my eye line. <laughs> How are you, Woodcut? What is happening? Hi, Hussein. Hi, Chad. Like, so I haven't seen this yet, but like, so making Jet black is chill. Like, I have no problem with that. But like, did they just write everything around how he's like a black person? Does he announce that he's like a black person and every other character just constantly say he's black regularly? Like, what the fuck's happening? Like, why couldn't he just be black and then everyone react in, the, in a normal way, in the way that you're supposed to react when you are around just any human being? You know what I mean? What, what happened? Jet wasn't black in the anime. He, I'm. Mean, who cares? Um. Who cares? It's a fucking anime, right? And making his character like making his character black, I don't have a problem with. What I do have a problem with is. What I do have a problem with is like everyone being like, "Uh huh, I can't believe you're black, Jet. <laughs> You've always been black." <laughs> like every what like. In a weird way where they're like, they once again, once again, uh, liberals fucking botching representation. Been here for 11 of them things. <laughs> Chat obviously hasn't seen the show. This is pretty much the only scene where his race is brought up and it's because she's being all creepy. Okay. He was fucking green in the anime? No, he wasn't. Hassle, hassle, hassle. His voice actor was black. I think that's why. The, the Western voice actor, right? That's what you mean. If only he could find those chaos emeralds, maybe he should ask your dad. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did he just did this dude just fucking sound. keep up the awesome work? Dexter, if you're watching, keep up the oh awesome work. Oh my god. This person gave Elon Musk the the most insane ratio of all time. Ninety-seven thousand likes to Here Elon's fucking six K. Build shit. A man's man. That's insane. That's, uh, wow. Glorious, dude. Yeah, if I was Elon Musk, I would not be talking about emeralds. Like, I would not be bringing up emeralds. You know what I mean? Kind of a weird thing. Kind of a weird thing to bring up. I think you go to jail if you get ratioed this hard. I'm just saying, like... You literally go to jail for that, right? No shadow today. Oh, what the fuck? Bro, what is happening, bro? Oh, I really should have watched this last night. It's so bad. What is going on, dude? Bro, this is like... <laughs> there was a point... I, I have to admit. I have to admit. There was a point in time where I thought there could be... This could be salvaged. You know what I mean? There was a point in time where I thought this could be salvaged. Like, obviously, Ed's annoying regardless, but like... But what the fuck... Why does this yeah, have like Nickelodeon slime time energy, dude? This straight up looks like this literally looks like a Nickelodeon ad from the nineties, bro. Why? Why does it? Why does it look like that? It's so weird. Wait, to be honest, you realize how cringe anime actually is if it's converted into live action. Fuck weeb. I'm a weeb smoge. 
yeah i just i think you just can't you just cannot make a live action adaptation unless you like straight up change the dynamic entirely like ghost in the shell the versus Ronnie's the matrix you see what i'm saying gonna keep on fighting an they entirely separate fight. concept or uh you know that bites conceptually from other animes but is like still entirely separated from just like making a complete live action adaptation it's That's just nice. not going to happen you cannot there has never been an instance that I can think of where there is a live, there's a live adaptation of an anime that like comes across good. And like part of the thing is, listen, I think what people are realizing is that like Marvel is popping off. So they're trying to do that with, uh, you know, the Japanese version of that, right? Uh, John. And Marvel also still has, like, issues uh, because uh, the, the dialogue or the plot lines that you, like, add into, the, uh, into live action still has, like... 12 months. Like it's not exactly super well uh, written. You know what I mean? Like, let's be real. I love comic books. I grew up reading comic books, right? But the, the unfortunate reality is that, you know, it's not going to be that good. They've done a pretty decent job after years and years of trying and, and you know, finally they're, Thanks for being my favorite I mean, it's it just like, it's, it's really consumable. That doesn't mean it's necessarily great. But I don't know. They just like with anime, there's also, you know, cultural differences. There's also a, a translation a difference. You know what I mean? There's like an element that gets lost in translation. So it's like doubly, triply difficult. You know what I mean? There you go. No. Spike's baby. Not anymore. Yes, you are. You spike. Cowboy! Bounty hunter for hire! Wake up! I have a dog for you! A bounty! Mine? Batman! Big reward! We have to find the butterfly man! Boo! Danger, danger! Too low. Well. We have to find Velazio, Velazio, Velazio before he does spooky bad things. My man said, at least they got the dog right. Bro, that's like the one thing. Imagine they made fucking Ein like a Doberman or something. Uh, you would, everyone would have lost it, dude. Are you kidding me? 11 months. That would have been like the final fucking straw, dude. That, that's... How is it that bad? It's that bad because this does not translate, dude. This does not fucking translate, okay? It does not translate to live action, especially Western live action. Oh, this guy. Why do you think they dropped the charges for Rittenhouse traveling across state lines with a weapon as a minor? What was the point of that other than sabotage the ability of the families to sue for wrongful death when he was inevitably found not guilty of the murder slash manslaughter? First of all, he didn't travel across state lines with the gun. He got it when he was there. And secondly, uh, I, I, they were fucking biased. Okay, that's it. He's like a young, he's a young white kid. Uh, they're always going to be lenient towards a young conservative white kid who's LARPing as a fucking cop. I love you, Ajahn. 16 months down, many more to go. Keep it up, hassle. Also, his age is insane, dude. Uh, someone else also pointed it out in the chat, but like Spike Spiegel is like 28 or 29 or something. And this dude is like 48. What the fuck is happening, dude? Like, I'm sorry. This actor is great, but like, but like, what the fuck? What, what are you doing? Like, what, what are you doing? What, what are you doing? What are you fucking doing? Yeah, every part of this sucks. 
I haven't seen any clips from Faye, so I suspect that she actually didn't do poorly. Survived my monthly ad break once again. To be fair, 28 anime is ancient. Oh no, Faye's very bad. Wait, really? I haven't seen any fucking Faye uh, clips. Bro, listen. Hassle. Oh, she did. Fancy meal. You guys are so lucky that I ran into you. Meet, meet Jet, Spice Beagle, Jet Black, and Faye Valentine in the exclusive oh, clip. <laughs> fancy. <laughs> ah, look at you. You haven't had a fancy meal in weeks. <laughs> fancy. <laughs> Wait. Did they get his, like, actual voiceover guy to play the role? Because he does kind of sound like, he does kind of sound like Jet Black. Ah, look at you. Actually smiling. Yeah, probably at the prospect of unlimited fake cheesy bread. Yeah, well, whatever it is, I'll take it. Your brooding the last couple weeks has been getting on my... Oh, damn. <laughs> okay. Jet Black is, like, actually... That's actually good casting, I think. I mean, he sounds exactly like him. He sounds exactly like the, the, the dub. And I watched this sub, then I watched this dub. And it's got a pretty fucking good dub. Yeah. My nerves. I love this place. You know they have the bidets in the bathroom? Mm. Damn, things are addictive. Please tell me you're talking about the bread. Bidets. Quite therapeutic. Yeah. And that gentle warm water really eases the stress while washing out the nooks and crannies. One year wide people I'm begging you. Next big score. Oh my god, score why is he so addictive. Bro, this is insanity, dude. He's so bad. Why is he so bad? What is happening? He's so old. He looks more disheveled than Spike does. I mean, not Spike, fucking, uh, yeah. I, I, he just, oh, oh, every part of this is just wrong, dude. Will Neff after watching Cowboy Bebop. Day zero of watching Cowboy Bebop live action. Day zero, hour zero, minute zero, second one of action. <laughs> of watching live action Cowboy Bebop. <laughs> yeah, okay, man. First of all, guys, I like this actor. I, I think he's fine. Like, I have no problem with him, okay? But it is ridiculous. Like, he is not good for this fucking role, dude. <laughs> What the fuck? Stop Look, I work. and you cannot tell me I was not open minded. You cannot tell me that I was not looking for a good time. Okay? And boy was I wrong. I actually thought I actually thought that, you know, I'm gonna keep an open mind. I wanna make sure that this is like good. I want this to be good. And Will and I talked about this briefly, and Will was like, This is gonna suck dick. This is gonna suck dick. This is gonna suck dick, dude. You don't understand, dude. Please tell me you're talking about the bread. Bidet. Quite therapeutic. Yeah. And that gentle warm... Jed, a bidet is a toilet that cleans out your Just asshole. Just got in. Did you already watch the fake merch what? app? Hassler and Ariba Mexico Cabron is Como <laughs> You guys are so lucky oh. that I ran into you. Oh, oh no. Oh, do you mind? Ugh. What is that? Water. Oh, oh beer, thank God. Please, help yourself. Oh. Oh. Okay, so the craziest thing just happened. I was at the opera house when three eco dicks in gas masks storm in and release this gas that starts turning people into trees. No shit, trees. It was nutbags. I'll tell you what else is nutbags. Two nut more bags. months until brain rot dicks go. As soon as this hits the news, every cowboy in the solar system are gonna be after these assholes. But I got the jump on them, see? On account that they took my ship, which they stole, and which I could totally track. Just need a ride. It's a real boom, bang, bang. 15 hassle. It's a milk run. It's cakewalk. It's a few hours to make some easy woo. So, what do you say, fellas? You want to team up? She's high, right? Yeah, you see the bags under her eyes. Right. Venus Stardust would be my guess. I'm CW edit version? Maybe two. One for each foot. Jed, a bidet is a toilet that cleans out your asshole. 
<laughs> Bro, this is like, dude, this is like, doom, 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 <laughs> they bazingified this fucking thing, dude. This is straight Seinfeld, dude. What the fuck? Oh. Did I run into you? Oh. Oh. Jerry. Water. Oh. So the craziest thing just happened. I was at the opera house when three ego dicks in gas masks stormed. Like I'm just seeing, like, you know, Kramer fucking bust in with his hair shaking. Like, Spike, we gotta go. The eco terrorists want to turn everyone into monkeys, Spike. Monkeys. <laughs> Monkey Spike! <laughs> Not even Capuchins! Hassle. But like big, big apes! <laughs> in and release this gas that starts turning people into trees. No shit, trees. It was nutbags. I'll tell you what else is nutbags. <laughs> as soon as this hits the news, every cowboy in the solar system are gonna be after these assholes. I got the jump on him. Six months. On account, they took my ship, which they stole, and which I could totally track. Just need a ride. It's a real boom, bang, bang. <laughs> it's milk run. It's cakewalk. It's a few hours to make some easy woo. So. They changed even the plans to the monkeys because they couldn't even get that right. I mean, that's probably like, you know, whatever. They. For first of all, they didn't do that at the opera house, and I don't think Faye was there anyway, right? So this is this is probably a separate eco terrorist uh, plot line, I suspect, and not like the the fucking PETA one. Seven months, hell ye. What do you say, fellas? You want to team up? She's high, right? <laughs> you see the bags under her eyes. Right. Being a stardust would be my guess. I'm not high, Dick Waz. I'm telling the truth. Only cosmic crank makes you sweat. Like <laughs> oh, they jumbled it because. The opera plot line is when, um, what's his face? Is Spike's, uh, the opera plot line is supposed to be where, uh, Faye, it chases after like, uh, a, uh, the guy who's like leading the criminal syndicate, but that is like actually Spike's, uh, fucking, you know, that's the guy that Spike used to deal with. And the guy vicious that killed the head of the opera syndicate or the crime syndicate is there and it's in his stead. And then they fucking kidnap her. And then they bring her over to, uh, and then, you know, uh, I think, what, what was he like brought over to the church and then fucking there's like the, the cool fighting sequence and all this shit. Guys, you can't say spoilers to like, you literally can't say spoilers. This is a 30 year old anime. Everyone in here has seen it. Okay. And apparently the fucking Netflix version sucks dick anyway. So it doesn't even matter. Oh, and no, they fucking like weirdly ruined it. So shut the fuck up. Opera House. According to eyewitness reports, the toxic gas turned people into trees. Are you serious with this? I was thinking. Oh shit, that's nut bags. That's what she said. Okay, listen, listen, listen. Vicious is worse than Ed in the live action. No, y'all, dude, dude, what the fuck? Wait, what about? What about the fucking, uh, the cowboy, uh, the sequence? What was it called? The, how are you doing folks? What was the show? What was the show? The bounty show? What was that called? What is it? What does that look like? Bang, bang. Uh, Big shots. They <laughs> did that. <laughs> wait show me does anyone have it does anyone have the the fucking does the original cowboy bebop hold up still one million percent that is the beauty of anime is that it's literally timeless
The original Cowboy Bebop, 1 million percent holds up. 1 million percent. Go watch the original Cowboy Bebop. Fuck this shit. Straight up. It will always hold up. It's like, it, it's one of, there's a reason why it's like, it's, it's declared one of the greatest animes of all time. In the rain. In the rain. This is a little. <laughs> they don't even say shucks, howdy. It's insane. Hey, if you like this video, please subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. <laughs>